your garbage disposal. And see, this is the Badger 5 half horsepower, two year warranty. What typically happens is you can see this rusts quite a bit, but the main thing is this part here. This part here is the base of the whole unit and you can see it's rusted out right here. Rust marks there, rust holes. And we have rust holes here. This can actually be repaired. You can take JV Weld, clean this up really good. Uh, use some Osfo to neutralize the rust and JB weld it back together and so what you'll notice is it will drip out the bottom you can see the mineral trails here the white crusty stuff and it will typically drip and other than that it works fine so all you have to do is take this top off and this this actually will rust treat this we'll take some osphos phosphoric acid clean all this up so it neutralizes the rust and clean it up with a wire brush or some steel wool and just jb weld our blues away and uh so that's your garbage disposal tip for today thanks for watching if you need any help you can contact me i get phone advice for 25 dollars 707-443-8347 and just in case you're wondering how this all goes back together um so let's see this part actually goes this way so it goes these goes this way does it make are a it's like a uh, five millimeter and you can take these nuts out that hold this thing together up through the top here Okay, okay, next morning. So this is actually all sealed up now. What I used was the white uh, in the tube Gorilla Glue. Ideally, you want to use E6000, but the Gorilla Glue, glue is what I had on hand. I'm going to put another coat on it, and I'm going to sand this, and I'm going to sand that a little bit, and then paint it, and then... Uh, put a little goop on the edges here some silicone and put it back together and that one will be back in life again back to life again okay there it is I put this uh, rust-oleum metallic finish on it spray painted a bit and then I put another coat of this stuff here this is the automotive goop and uh, then I'm gonna put some sealer around this edge here and then put it back together Okay, so I use this high temperature sealer to make that seal. And when you put when I put when I took it apart and I'm putting it back together, I take that that five mil and put it on the end of a screwdriver and just go like that. And that's how I uh, that's how I access these. These are kind of tricky uh, nuts to uh, to mess with.